the Teskey Brothers. The Teskey Brothers, bro. So, I can't even call this the Teskey Brothers because I'm assuming it's just the Teskey Brother, the one that leads the songs. Um, so, I'm assuming the voice of the group. But, shout out New Zealand. And also, I'm going to throw some love to the Philippines also. Because when I first started YouTube, and I'm going to be real, everybody's like this, but a lot of people... Um, and I can only speak for where I've been and for where I live, but I've noticed that a lot of people here, you tell them to, to look at something that's somewhere else, like an artist, check out this artist from New Zealand, check out this artist from the Philippines, check out the artist from wherever, right? That's outside the country. A lot of us, I think that we're so brainwashed to be so narcissistic and so brainwashed to think that everything in America is just the top, it's just the best, no matter what it is. And we're like, bro, what? But I've had my eyes opened by New Zealand artists. I've had my eyes opened by artists in the Philippines. And I'm saying that to say this, keep your mind open, keep your, keep your options open. Always have an open mind when listening to something, when going into anything, because you just don't know. A lot of people that I've encountered seem to be closed off to that. They don't, you tell, you tell them, hey, listen to the Teskey Brothers. What, who are they? They're artists in New Zealand. They're like, New Zealand? Oh. They may not say that to your face, but on the inside, but little do they know, if they would listen to the Teskey Brothers, they might hear some great music, some music that they enjoy. I, that happened to me when I listened to Pain. What? I, I empathize completely with that song, but this is the Teskey Brothers' Rain. Guess what I mean? But the Teskey Brothers' Rain, the Teskey Brother live. No further ado, let's get into the video. Mm -hmm. oh. Oh. Teskey Brothers and Chris Stapleton. That would be crazy. But, okay, so the thing is, I did a Teskey's Brother reaction not too long ago. I want to say about two months ago, right? It was the pain, right? And, like, I didn't forget what his voice sounded like, but I forgot the impact because, boy... As soon as he opened his mouth and it came out, I felt it. I felt it. I I just imagine myself sitting on the porch. Oh, am I in a cabin? Am I in like a wooden house? Behind me is wood. Forest, right? No, um, I'm enjoying life. It's raining outside. I don't know if I have a screen or not, but I'm just on it. What? My dog is sleeping right next to me. Maybe a fire. Maybe a fire. I don't know. But... I'm just in my rocky channel. I'm just reminiscing. Maybe I got a cold one open. I just don't. <laughs> Maybe I do. <laughs> Maybe I don't. But boy, a scenery just hit me. Dude, Suji started. Hey, if I could, if I can hold you, my fam. It's a lonely base, but I know it's hard, and I know it's hard to be alone. Clouds 
girl Hey, I realized with this, and I just realized this now, but with this kind of voice, you can't sing about good times. You can't sing about happy times. You got it. With this type of voice, I don't want to hear nothing but pain. <laughs> I don't want to hear nothing but sorrow. I don't want to hear nothing about, ref I, I, don't, I only want to hear about pain, sorrow, and reflection. Right? This voice is tailor-made for that. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Next time I go to a cabin, next time I go to Tennessee, I might, I'm going to bring a speaker. I might not, and I might not just play nothing but the Teskey Brothers. It's just sit on my rocking chair and just... <laughs> and just go through the motion. Just go... Just feel it. Just... And the crazy thing is, I'm talking like I'm 65, I'm 55, I'm only 24 years old. Like, I done been through so much, but, hey, I'm telling you, I like his voice, man. It's husky. <laughs> it's husky. It's a lonely face, and I know it's hard, and I know it's hard to be alone, to be alone. Y'all give me y'all opinion on this. You know how you can say people are past their time, right? If the Teskey Brothers came out in the 60s, 50s, 60s, are they global? I think so. I think so. Now, I don't know exactly. I've never been to New Zealand. I would love to go, but I don't know exactly how big they are, right? But 50s, I'm thinking they come out around like 1957. They come out around 1957. Between 1957 and 1963, they're taking off. To the stars. <laughs> they're taking off. That's just how I feel about his voice. Like... That's the time period that his voice reminds me. I'm done. I can't, can I say reminds me of? Because I never lived in that time period. But um, it's similar to, I think his voice is similar to the voices in that time period. Not too many people from what I've heard. And I could just be ignorant. So if I am, just take what I'm saying with a grain of salt. But if I'm not. 
what? The way he hit it, mm. let it simmer and then just smoothed it out with a knife. The way, what? It's literally like putting a slab of butter on bread. <coughs> you put it on the right, he hit the note. You you let it sit, you know what I'm saying? It's on the bread. You don't immediately smooth it out, but you let the, the hot bread is a little hot, you know what I'm saying? And you just smooth it out with a knife. You just, that's how he just listen, y'all gonna y'all gonna understand the, the the imagery when you hear it again. I wanna hold up. Mr. Teske, I don't know. Oh, I was about to, <laughs> hey, to cut y'all off. But listen, Mr. Teske, um, phenomenal singing. Phenomenal. As a brother, are you in? <laughs> if I'm a brother, I guess the brothers are. Um, I wonder how that's what that's like though in a in a in a mu musical group. Right, when only one brother can sing, the other ones they they may be um, gifted in the way of instruments. I don't know if they can sing. I don't know if they can. But from what I've seen, the two videos I'm limited to two videos. Keep that in mind. He's the lead singer. So are you jealous? Are you just letting him while he's singing? Like I can just punch you in the back of the head. How do you feel? It's like ah, with a voice like that. Mr. Teske, wow. Wow. I, I I honestly think I think I could be a unicorn because I listen to music like this. I like music like this. But my generation, and then once again, keep in mind that I'm very limited. I've only been around a small group of people. I've never met everybody in my life, so I can't, but in the group that I've been in, it seems like you would be your past your time and I hate that for you. And I'm not saying that you're not gonna get a lot of hits because I think you, this has three million views, right? I love your music. I think you're um, under hyped, not as big as you should be, right? But I think that's just a part of my generation. I just, ah, I would love to have seen 60, 60, 57 and 63. That's what I'm thinking with your voices, but I enjoy it. I, I, this is being downloaded. Um, I don't know if it's the same as the studio version as the official version, but I enjoyed this, man. Honestly, I, I, I felt this, I, to the core of my rib. <laughs> You were supposed to be, baby, you were supposed to be my rib. But that's all I got for the video, y'all. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'll be with you guys next time. I'm out.